Speed Duel GX Midterm Paradox is here, and uh, where all the value at, though? Make sure you guys smash the crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out more awesome content. We have the spoilers coming across from the Yugi Tubers today. You have all of your secret rares pictured on up here. Uh, little things to note from the set Nova Master got a common, Hero Lives got a common, Curse Steel the Forbidden Spell got a reprint, Doggeron got a reprint. Geek Guardian got a common reprint. I uh, That's everything that I cared about within the box. I mean, yeah, the skill cards are cool, but your hollows here. Is this, uh, is this a metaverse selling set? Well, not exactly. Uh, Geek Guardian, Sangha, Kazujin, and Suijin all got seekers. Now, personally, as a collector, I'm glad to see that these did get reprinted. I'm still hoping in some set somewhere along the way that Konami's going to go, oh, Boy, maybe we should, maybe we should give some upgraded support to you know those <laughs> cards because they are some of the earliest cards within the game, but they just never have been revisited. So it feels to me like there's an open spot there um, that could definitely be explored there. Now, UFO Roid Fighter and Tempest both got reprints in this. Um, those were the chosen hero cards. I mean, makes sense for the block of the anime that they're focusing in on here. Um, Cyrus Truesdale got its Drillroid. Now, I'm happy that Drillroid did get a hollow upgrade after years. As somebody that played Drillroid in like some very old formats, this is a pretty cool addition. Uh, we also got the Super Vehicle Jumbo Drill. I'm whatever about that. <laughs> um, it's kind of cool, I guess. And like Water Dragon getting a Seeker Air is kind of cool as well. But like, there's nothing too like that. Oh, wait, Bubble Man got a reprint? Yeah, Bubble Man did in fact get a Seeker Air. And a lot of people are actually very happy about the secret of Hero Lives. Um, having one more higher rarity in circulation for a Hero Lives, I think, is a good thing. A majority of the community is pretty excited for that. And then the competitive value out of this set, I think, was the Doggeron getting a Seeker Rare print. I know a lot of people that were watching the openings was like, oh my god, you're like, Seeker Rare Doggeron. I mean, personally, I'm excited for, like, Gate Guardian, its pieces, and Doggeron. Like, that's, that's to me, the value. The sad part is you don't even pull off your Gate Guardian pieces together. I was seeing, like, two and three. I think there's one one video that had, like, a Gate Guardian, a Kazudin, and a Suogen, and then a Fusion, and you're just like... Why? So, uh, you don't even get a chance to pull them together. But in terms of value, yeah. This is definitely not as good as the first one, for sure. But nonetheless, what do you guys think? Please leave a comment down below, tell me what you guys think. And I'll see your beautiful faces back here later in the day, guys. Patrons, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.